Mike Sykes said uh, you put a foot up there, uh, up their butts a little bit, and, and that that fired them up. Was that how it worked? Uh, I, I, it's a nice way of putting it, I, I think. And uh, you know, I think we uh, all got a little frustrated, but you know, uh, you got to credit them. They they played really hard today, and I think really outplayed us. You know, for the first eight innings, and I was just you know disappointed that uh, you know uh, offensively we weren't doing much, and uh, and we let some some things happen to us uh, on defense where they weren't errors but there were plays that we didn't make and uh, um, and so you know a little, little disappointed there in the middle of the game. At what point did you look down and realize you didn't have a pitcher? Wyatt went down right there. Did you, did you have a kind of a moment where you went, hey, might we get somebody warmed up? Or, or well, I, I think at one point when I yelled at Errol, I said, hey, hey, you're, you're, you're the tie and run. I don't know if you realize this, but you're the tie and run. And that was, you know, a couple batters before he got up. And uh, once we got to that point, I wanted to make sure, uh, you know, just that, that, that he was ready, but he was already down in the pen, and uh, obviously he can get loose fast. And I think with so much adrenaline running through this stadium, you know, it took about three pitches. But that's one of the things I think will get lost today, and all the excitement is how special he was this weekend. Two saves and a win, you know, uh, pitching three days in a row against your arch rival Mississippi kid. Uh, you know, what a terrific weekend for Wyatt. Anderson probably. That's another story that will get lost. Yeah, you know, no doubt. And you know, we all know that you know we've had our issues. Besides the you know five or six guys, and and he really you know bridged it there. And uh, you know part of you know talking about what you're thinking about in the ninth inning. I think we're thinking about the two runs that we let up. You know uh, where we could have gotten out the ninth at five to two. Uh, and uh, but uh, you know Evan you know really held it together and, and gave us the opportunity. Getting the sweep, especially the way today happened. I guess starting to find yourself a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I hope so. You know, th those are the questions that I always say. My patented answer is, we'll see. You know, right. we'll, we'll see down the road, and uh, you know what games that, you know that, that really kind of turn your season. Uh, I, I laugh with the guys that think we're four game, four wins now, the longest win streak of right. the year. Uh, ironically, you know, it's a, it's amazing. Uh, but th we we're playing much better now. You, you can see that the kids are playing with confidence. And today, again, maybe on a game that we, we didn't play well early, uh, there was enough on the mound with Weathersby, and he didn't pitch that great yeah. uh, to, to keep it close and to keep them. You know, from from you know extend, extending the lead to, to a point where we couldn't come back. So how, how much of playing well now is just you had so many new faces. Well, I think offensively, that there's no doubt that's that's a huge factor. You know, I think everybody uh, swings better in April and May than they do February and March. If you look, you know, every year uh, ERAs balloon, batting averages go up, regardless if you have a young team or not. But I think certainly the young guys. Uh, Keith told me we had 27,000. I mean, for the young guys to walk out on that the first, you know, couple weeks, you know, uh, we, we enter squad in front of 100. And so, you know, uh, I think, you know, there's a, a learning curve for some people, but obviously they're, we're playing a lot better now. You waited a second to pitch run for Austin. You got a pretty good secondary off second and read that pretty well. Getting the Terrific. And the reason for that, we had already put, played Lertig right. and Perkins was in as the DH. And, you know, were we ready to lose the DH, you know, you know at that time? And, you know, what wasn't really sure, you know, that was the right move. And, uh, and sometimes it comes and gets you because, Maybe a, a slow guy like Austin doesn't advance, but once he advances on that, um, you got to go for it. And you know, you got to put your fastest guy in. And you know, uh, you know fortunately, you know, we had a, still a fast position player left in Tate Blackman. There's two outs there. You kind of just let the lineup play through. Did you ever think about Wayne House for Arrow or try to do something to get one swing? Or just... no, I, I, you know, I think you know when you get to this point in the season, you know, you, you start to know the guys a little bit better, and you know, nobody's. You know, got a, a, a flair for the dramatic more than Errol, and uh, and uh, and I mean that as a compliment. I, I mean that that's why he's he's so good. Uh, you know, he, he had a terrific weekend, obviously, but he's he's his best when the game's on the line. And uh, you know, right now that 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 that's our best nine. And so you know, uh, we, we did one. Uh, I think we pinch hit Lertig, You know, in that that inning. But besides that, uh, and all and be really honest with you with Watson, you know, still we're down by five. He needs at bats because he might be playing for a while. And you know, he hadn't been playing regular. So, you know, you know, there's a few reasons for those. I was gonna ask you about that. Do you know more about Connor today? <laughs> I really don't. Uh, it's a strained oblique. And uh, doctor saw him last night. Uh, they put him on some medicine, he started treatments last night. Absolutely no way he could play today. Um, 
Uh, I don't think there's a chance it could play on Tuesday, but I don't want to get ahead of myself. You know, it would be the proverbial football day to day. Uh, but I don't, you know, I wouldn't think that he could, you know, have a chance to play before this weekend. You know, you might throw on Tuesday. No, sorry. Yeah. Thank you, Mike. Is that funny? Thank you.